Hi Instagram, hi Facebook. Right, we're back. We're going to move you around. And Amanda, now, talk us through what you're doing, Amanda. Okay, so I've placed the giant dahlias in there and it did look really, really beautiful uh, on its own with actually that the rose, but we, we needed a really strong focal. So this stunning colour, uh, actually, uh, we're going to make a really nice strong line all the way through. Uh, to, for the eye to follow through, but it's actually connecting with all of the foliages and the bracts on the abelia. Uh, yeah, so it looks really pretty with Absolutely that. Absolutely stunning, um, yeah. Uh, and so now we've got a really strong focal line as well. Uh, and then um, and then that will be me done once these roses are in. Wow, we'll, we'll take some photos of the finished designs for everybody. That's looking gorgeous, thank you. Catherine, how are you getting on over here? Well, I'm drinking tea, actually. Drinking tea? <laughs> Um, Would you mind finishing it off, please? Yeah, We've got well, people actually, waiting. This is the first, oh no, actually, it's second cup of tea since. <laughs> so if you come to the academy, you will realise that actually drinking tea is an integral part of studying <laughs> with us. So, yes, I've just, um, I've now put some clematis in, which just, it gives more space. So, if you can see how much space you've got here, um, that really makes the design look so much bigger, but you don't have to fill it with flowers. So often the tendency is to think, I've got to make something very big, I need to fill it all with flowers. But by creating space, that enables us to see the recessed flowers, so the little tiny roses that I showed you earlier are recessed in here, whereas the longer stems of the astilbe and the tomatoes and the grasses are coming out here, and you've got all that free space inside. That's beautiful. So, and look, to spin it round, because it's so lovely to see an all-round design. So this would look great, you know, you imagine those big um, entrance halls for hotels yeah. where you walk in and you've got a huge table in the middle. Or if you've got a church with maybe a font which has got a yeah. flat in it, that would look great on a church font. Yeah. Um, or if you've got a nice big dining table at home. Well, why not? Why are your friends? And yeah. Uh, so lots of uses. Or you could put it on a pedestal, a plinth, again, for a wedding or event. Yeah, brilliant. That's absolutely stunning. I think my favourite angle is that. that Look at that. That's really yeah, because that's so all favorite. the colours there. Brilliant. We'll take the, we'll take some beautiful photos of those later. And then Karen, you've just been working on bringing the orange down into the design. I have. So uh, because it was quite top heavy, and these are these are um, ten metre fold in as well. Oh, sorry, not getting you in. Talk, so, um, <laughs> talking. We put some of these lovely um, red hot pokers which people probably um, conifer I think that people have in their oh, gardens yeah. and look at that the curve of the head there it's like a little seahorse yeah um, so just threading that through so that we've got sort of like our eight area here so it's mm -hmm. nice and strong but I am just bringing some more of the crocosmia through just about long enough yeah uh, so that's going to thread through this area here might put a touch of it just down at the bottom just to lift this textured base yeah and then finally just a few pieces of the amaranth oh lovely there. again we'll take a photograph of that thank you everyone that is stunning and lovely and nice thing about the parallel one is that you can sorry karen you can see right tea. Just tea again so you can see right through the design so great for windows so we'll probably place that one in the window later for a photo shoot oh my goodness amanda it's getting bigger no, I know, I can't stop. <laughs> <laughs> it's taking over. So, what, thank you so much for joining us this morning. Hi, Zara. Hi, Terry. Thank you so much. Um, hi, Desmelza. And um, I'm sorry, I can't read. Nutsford. Hmm? Nutsford. Oh, Nutsford, sorry. <laughs> So, Nutsford Bloom, welcome. Thank you very much for joining us all. What we're going to do is we're going having a break for lunch, and then this afternoon we've got the students that are just going to make a few designs as well. Um, and then we'll probably come back in um, a bit later on today, about three o'clock, and show you what they've made and do a sort of final wrap. So, thank you so much. I'm hoping you're enjoying it. It's lovely to see you all, and um, yeah, hopefully, it's inspiring you to go and make something yourself. So thank you very much, Instagram, and thank you very much, Facebook, for joining us. See you later. Bye. Bye.